<laughs> Sir, we do have we have some trophies from Phoenix, and, and uh, we'll be there in two weeks racing. So uh, look looking forward, forward to seeing that. you. And uh, really grateful for your attention on our sport here. Uh, big impact to North Carolina, uh, NASCAR and motorsports industries. About a six billion dollar annual impact to our state. Uh, Twenty four thousand impact mm. employment, and uh, very very appreciative of the support from from the leadership and, and uh, supporting our industry. Could I point out again? It's the biggest sporting event. State of the with 130,000 people. Yes, sir. And they come a couple of days early in RVs, park them out around the raceway. It's really quite an event. It is. It's an event that kind of tide floats all boats. But once the green flag falls at the track, it's every man for himself. And that's really the nature of NASCAR racing. Um, with, there are no team orders. It, it's uh, best finisher. We actually saw that this weekend where um, Jeff Gordon is contending for the championship. Uh, and Dale Earnhardt Jr. is not in that championship hunt right now, but he was going for a win. If Jeff had finished first, he would have locked in to that cut round we're going to have out at Phoenix. But Dale Earnhardt Jr. wasn't about to give him any uh, any room there. If you take a look at the uh, the situation we're dealing with in Iraq, it's a it's a problem that President Obama created by not leaving residual forces and having some stability there. So what Senator Graham is talking.